to be falsely accused of a sex crime is about as grim an experience as it's possible for us to imagine. Maybe this is part of the answer. And I guess in a way, we can all imagine it happening to us. You could just about imagine it happening. And it would be horrible. Therefore, we have epic sympathy for Lord Bramall. But not as much sympathy as I have for the children who were raped by politicians. That's where I'm absolutely lost on the coverage of this story. You hear people, you read them, you watch them on the television, and they talk about witch hunts, and they talk about climb downs. They've even put the word humiliating into the description of what the Metropolitan Police have to do now. The humiliating climb down. Because they took an accusation seriously, they treated the accuser with respect and dignity, and it turns out they might have been misled. What do you want to see in response to a story like that? Do you want to see every woman coming forward alleging rape to be treated like a liar? Which is what used to happen in this country. Is that what these men want? They want to go back to the days when all children were told to shut up and that the priest would never do anything like that. You shut up, you wash your mouth. Don't you say that about your uncle, you disgusting little child. Here, have a clout to add to the fact that you've just been sexually abused. And I turn to my peers in the media in this country and they seem to celebrate when something turns out not to be true because it proves that institutional scepticism is the way forward. And I stare... And I stare and I stare at these stories and I wait for the penny to drop. I wait for the shaft of light to shine into this coverage in a way that makes me see it somehow differently from celebrating. Celebrating when a witness turns out to be mentally fragile and not telling the truth. But looking the other way and sticking your head in the sand and studiously ignoring the fact that there are still men in the House of Commons who stood up and cheered when Greville Janna came back from facing accusations by a child rapist called Frank Beck that Greville Janna was his partner in crime. I do not understand it. 